you, but this is for all three of you. Okay. So organizational discipline as it relates to that. Like that's that's kind of right? Wouldn't that be kind of the main driver for all mm. this? Whether it's strategic direction, delivering on margin management, whatever else. Do you want to speak to that real fast or just your experiences? Organizational discipline is I mean I I I I mean it's I think it's about hard work. I think it's about, you know, uh, if you I think if you want an organization, I think if your question you're asking, if you want an organization to change to, right. you know, we are here, we want to get better at X, that it's about hard work. It's about, you know, repetition. It's about recognizing what the knowledge gaps are and, you know, going at those in, in all sorts of ways. You know, let me educate at the high level. Let me go one to one. Let me, uh, let me put the time and effort in. It's no surprise that you know, whatever, the best footballers in the world are the ones that are on the training ground for longest or the best cellists in the world, you know, do most. That's, you know, that, that's, that's what it really is about. And I think as an organization, again, you have to have that discipline. Tying it back into what I was saying earlier on about strategy, you can't do 700 things at any one time. You pick the things that are important, right. you stick to them, you're committed to them, and you, and you, you keep coming back to it. If, if being, being more financially aware and making better financial decisions at the client point or, or as a business as a whole is important, you've got to put together a package of activities that's really going to hit that and, uh, and you know, measure how well you're doing at it periodically. And, um, I, 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 don't, I don't think there's any magic behind it. I think it's just you know, good, good execution sort of discipline. Yeah, I think that's good. Yeah, were you going to add something before? I, I was going to echo what, what you were saying then, but I, I think part of the key is to just identify a few specific objectives that people understand and can manage around. Um, I think there's quite a temptation to develop loads and loads of KPIs about all sorts of measurements, particularly around part partner behavior, which are not terribly well understood. And I think where, where I've seen it more effectively used is where the, where the people are managing that process with the organizational discipline just to say, well, this is what we're going to stick to. So for example, going back to the gross margin thing, we've seen that used really effectively in one, one particular area of our business where it's truly ingrained into pretty much everything they do now. And they really understand that, and they, they can work to it, and they know what the levers are. So I think it's small numbers of things well managed yeah. will be a key. Uh, hard work, obviously. <laughs>